Welcome back to Let's Play No One Lives Forever. I'm Burning Dog Face. And I need to sneak past these goons. Halt! Shit. Alright, alright. F9, F9. What is happening? I don't know what happened there. Everything locked up for a second and then started working again. Fine, we will do this the uh, more straightforward way. Oh, God. Come on! Again with a dick shot. Sorry about that. No, it's not the right button. There we go. I wanted to be able to kill him with as little shots as possible, you see. I'll just leave him writhing in agony. Alright. Uh, how do I do this yet? Yeah, F, that's right. I just did this. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. Need to kill such an erudite and educated uh, opponent. I mean, you are literally terrorists, but you know, still, I will feel kind of bad about it for a while. <clears throat> oh yes, that's right. I didn't actually get to check that door, so I tripped the light when I did that. Huh. Sloppy goatee, if I've ever seen one. Alright, out of curiosity. The uh, red crates do not explode. What? The game normally loads so quickly that this is the first time I even realized the word loading was animated. What is happening? Okay, so, uh, it just hangs there forever. And I've quit the game and, uh, loaded again. And every time I click continue, it just goes to that loading screen. The frame rate drops to... I, I'm pointing up here because I can see a frame rate counter up here. Sorry. Um, frame rate drops to 10, and everything just hangs there forever. And then when I get escape or, you know, whatever, it just says the program has encountered an error. Oh, Christ. Oh, God damn it. Ah, uh, no, that was forever ago. That's not good, any good at all. Shitting. How about now? Now does it dark? No, 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 there it goes. Fuck. There. There she comes! Thanks, miss. I owe you my life. Just keep your head down till this is over. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna play through this whole damn session again, and, uh, section again. And then I'll catch up with you on the other side. Not happy about this. Fuck. Ahem. Grrrr. 
It's not all bad. I found this uh, intel item I missed for the first time through the kitchen. Uncle Friedrich's bacon soup. Eight cups pork broth. Two chopped onions. Two tablespoons of garlic. One cup of sweet relish. One pound bacon. Boil six hours or until spoon stands on end in pot. Serve warm. Hmm. I'm no expert, but that kind of sounds disgusting to me. Really? Okay. Got through it a lot faster without all the cutscenes or, uh... ...such. Yeah, this one. Don't let criminals drink three times as much alcohol as law-abiding citizens. Zombie. Okay then. Let's do that again because I had the wrong type of ammo in. This time, no fucking loading. Huh. Oh, right. done, me. Thanks, me. Hey. There is a Unity safe house in Bremen, near the docks where you are to rendezvous with Agent Goodman. Stop there on your way and submit a status report to command. You should also equip yourself for the mission ahead. Here in wherever we are? What was the name of that nightclub again? Das Einsame Valkyrie. Ah, yes, here it is. The proprietor's name is Wagner. Inga Wagner. Ring any bells? We've got a file on her. She's supposedly a distant relation of Richard Wagner's, although I don't believe that connection has ever been adequately established. Nonetheless, as a child, she was constantly pressured by her parents to become an opera singer, presumably in order to continue the family legacy. The only problem was that she was completely tone-deaf. The combination of her parents' unyielding devotion and the inevitable series of rejections she encountered once she began to audition seems to have warped her mind in unhealthy ah, ways. Water. As a young woman, she had several run-ins with the West German authorities, initially involving complaints about her impromptu public concerts, but eventually blossoming into allegations of smuggling, extortion, money laundering, and even murder. It's entirely possible she's fallen in with harm. Find out what you can. Very good, sir. Be careful, Archer. I'll be fine. Welcome to Advanced Field Tactics. What are you doing here? We've modified your cigarette lighter. It now features a built-in miniature welder. The flame should be just hot enough to cut through padlocks that can't be picked or shot off. Look for locks with dials instead of keyholes. Try welding these locks off. Neat. We've 
developed a new lipstick explosive for you. This one has a three second timer, which will allow you to bank it around corners or seek cover before it detonates. Timed explosive. I see it's got a nice shade of orange. You want me to blow up Leon? No, it's one of those dummies, isn't it? Not a person at all! Oh god. Can't confiscate that. The elite guard. I'm so bloody bored. I never have any fun. Me neither. Okay. I'm going to assume they're villains of some kind. Hip chicks with big guns. Rank a victim. Meet Agent Goodman at the Bremen docks. Your first goal will be to get aboard the cargo freighter. Once aboard, you must locate the captain's log and the shipping manifest. Also, photograph any suspicious chemical containers you find. Noted. Rendezvous with Agent Goodman. Get aboard the cargo freighter, photograph the shipping manifest and the captain's log, trace tracking beacon and radio room. Yeah, this uh, actually seems pretty good. Get rid of that. Oh, that would be silenced, wouldn't it? Hmm. I'm just kind of surprised to see that it's actually listed as an AK-47, given that, for some reason, most games seem to just make up their own name for it. Hmm. All right, um... I thought the sleeping gas would be really handy, but then it turns out they just get the fuck up. Kinda wanna try to spring this with me, because that was really good. It was more accurate than the uh, SMG. Wait. Why is it on here twice? Never mind. I just won't think about that. Do I want to take the scope for the rifle or not? Yeah, okay, let's take that. This looks like the place. Sorry about that. Nice to meet you, Keith. This is an impressive operation you guys got going here. I hear you used to work over at Misery. Were you involved in that giant laser incident? You heard about that? Heck yeah. We had a betting pool. I was so sure you guys were going to vaporize the Empire State Building. Oops. I guess I owe you some money then. What happened, anyway? We hired some non-union technicians to put in the cooling system. No kidding. What a nightmare. 
Tell me about it. It's amazing the whole secret base didn't blow up. It pays to hire professionals. Anyway, welcome aboard, Keith. Good to have you on the team. I appreciate it. I've got a good feeling about this organization. Something over there. Oh, my. Uh... Sorry, I decided he was going to be a civilian. This looks like the place. Alright, he seems to be standing right in front of the gate. Hey, Brady, I want you to meet somebody. What is it? And everybody noticed except him. Oh, Strange, well. I really thought I heard something, but... That's better. Sorry, Keith. Union or not, crime doesn't pay. Ah. <laughs> uh -huh. This is far and away the stealthiest I've ever been in this game. So when are we going to hear that I was shot with a tracking device at the nightclub? Just curious. I really wish this thing had more ammo. Nice. Before he fired a shot. So here's what I'm going to do. Loading works again. Oh, I do so hate coming with... Dumb. We all just ran in at once. Gunther, I've had it with a stupid organization. To buy myself some time, I opened the mainstream valve and hit the handle in a pool of acid. Sorry of the inconvenience, but I doubt that Schwein Brady would approve of me leaving. Hans. Hans got out while the getting was good. Quite 
None of those are real. Oh, I don't like this at all. That would be the pool of acid, I guess. I don't think I want to climb that ladder. Everything's moving kind of jerkily. The frame rate is fine. Not without a valve handle. Well, where is the valve handle? Why isn't it here? Mueller took it. Why? As a joke. Where did he put it? I don't know. Where is he? I don't know. Great. When I find him, he's fired. He didn't mean any harm. Have you seen the missing steam valve? The pressure buildup is causing hazardous leaks all over the place. Please replace the valve before I'm pleased to use Turner Measures, Lieutenant Brady. Hello? A bit of the imagination, eh? There's the valve handle, but I don't know how to get it without dying. Alright. Well, that's not the solution. Can't just seem to do that. Fucking really? What do they offer you the damn pistol? Oh, is there anyone there? Okay, that's very clearly something I'm supposed to read, yet I cannot actually interact with it. Not Warning, the electrical system in warehouse 892 is currently under repair. Tampering with the system may result in loss of power. Uh. Well, I'm not going to get through there. Oh! Of course. Aha. Harm memo to maintenance from Foreman Vanderberg. I've received shipment of 37 fuel barrels at warehouse 830 uh, and 93. Why? Advise. I really like the impression that uh, the evil organizations talk to each other. I don't think that makes any sense given the shape of that, con that container, but I'll allow it. Well, that's uh, kind of a kick in the crotch. down, right? See, my sense of direction isn't so terrible and the areas actually look different. Alright, fine, there is a vent in there, I'll allow it. I keep saying that.
Okay. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play No One Lives Forever when we, uh, find out how far we can get now that the steam is gone. Later.